Hello, this is Carmen from the Singer Featherweight Shop, and today I want to talk about a fairly common problem or question that we get here in the shop, and that is why when I press on my foot pedal, does the light dim and go off? Well, the answer has to do with the wiring being reversed on either the, either the foot controller or the uh, machine itself. Today we're just going to deal with if it is the foot controller, and the way that you would determine which it is, is if you took your foot controller and, and if you have the luxury of multiple featherweights or if you have a friend that you can borrow their featherweight, uh, try the, the foot controller on another machine. If the problem repeats, then the, the foot controller is the problem. If the problem does not repeat, then it is the wiring of the machine itself that is the problem. And we'll address that in a different, uh, in a different video. So what we've done is we've unplugged the machine uh, from the wall just so you don't get electrocuted. And the plug itself here, the part that goes in the machine, is held together with two screws. One I've already taken out. There's a little nut on the back side. And then a screw. And once you take it apart, or once you take the screws out, you'll see, you can flip it over and you'll see the wiring. I've got another uh, piece here just like it and it's got some numbers and I'll explain those numbers here. The way it should properly be uh, wired would be that the cord, because there's two cords coming in here, the cord that goes to the wall, uh, meaning the, uh, the outlet, is in positions one and three. The other cord that's coming from the foot controller, those two wires are into one and two. So what we've got here in this example is we've got these wires that are reversed. Once you put them back in the correct way, you can put the put the cover back on. Put the screws in, and that should solve your problem. Okay, we've reassembled the plug, we've reversed the wires, and now the light does not shut off. So to recap, what we've done is we've reversed wires two and three and that takes care of the problem. So the cord from your outlet goes to position one and three, and the cords from your foot controller go to positions one and two. That means this one right here has two cords, two wires going into it. These each have one. Now, also we have a, in the downloadable uh, workshop uh, booklet, there's a diagram that explains all this in there as well. It's available on our website. And you're always welcome to call the shop and I, I'd be glad to walk you through any of these any of these wiring issues. We also have a, a, um, a foot controller rewiring service that we do. So if, if dealing with these little wires and getting it all put back together is not something you want to tackle, uh, that's fine. You can send it to us and, and we will do that. So I hope this video helps, and later we'll address uh, what happens if it's not the foot controller, but it's the wiring on the machine that has been reversed.